Boom! Was that the sound of the explosion of Samsung Galaxy Note 7? Well, probably not because Samsung recalled all of them. And Note series almost went down the drain. But Samsung Galaxy Note 8 launched with lots of features and those were amazing features with a beautiful looking device. And Samsung was back on top with their Note series. Well, Samsung is gearing up to launch the Samsung Galaxy Note 9. So let's have a look at the Samsung Galaxy Note 9. Samsung Galaxy Note 9 will be featuring a 6.4 inch Super AMOLED display with an 18.5 is to 9 aspect ratio. That means they will not be copying iPhone X and going with a notch. They will not be having a notch. So that is good news for all the notch haters out there. And it will be having either a Snapdragon 845 system on chip or an Exynos 9810 SOC depending on the region. The handset is spotted to have 6GB of RAM and runs on Android 8.1 Audio out of the box. We expect that it will get Android P but probably not soon after its launch. Further, it is expected to have a huge 4000 mAh battery which should be more than enough to run for more than a day of use. And obviously it will be having a Quad HD Plus display and Samsung will probably stick with their Bixby button which many people hated because it was only mapped to work with Bixby and was not at all remap remappable. It will also be having Bixby 2.0 which was unveiled back in October last year and it was projected as a strong competitor against Google Assistant, Amazon's Alexa and Apple Siri though the Assistant hasn't debuted yet. Though this device probably will not be having the under the display fingerprint scanner that is being seen on vivo smartphones nowadays that is probably because samsung wouldn't want to experiment with their note or the s series because of its popularity so they will probably come out with an under the display fingerprint scanner when it is as fast as the normal fingerprint scanners that we see nowadays because the under the display scanners are a little slower than the existing fingerprint scanners and are not as much as reliable the, as the current fingerprint scanners. So Samsung will probably launch an under the display fingerprint scanner and test it out on a different smartphone series, maybe a J series smartphone or an A series smartphone and probably move it into the S series and the Note series next year. And talking about the launch, it will probably launch somewhere around September to October time frame. That is generally when Samsung comes out with their Note series and they would definitely want this device to be a success. So what do you think about this beast of a device? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And obviously, to compete with Apple, they will be having a 3.5mm phone jack as well as memory card expansion. So this device is making me excited. What do you think?